In the 15th century, Italy and Hungary had very close relations. Hungary was hugely influenced by the Renaissance in Florence and its king, Matthias Corvinus, set up universities and started libraries. He supported the arts and science and even started a new legal system in Hungary. We wanted uh, to show these relations and also from a predecessor of uh, Matthias Corvinus, Sigismund of Luxembourg, the emperor and also Hungarian king. This exhibition shows the close relationship between the two countries and the number of Italians who lived in Hungarian courts and many Florentine masters were employed by the king. A lot of uh, uh, artists who arrived to Hungary and worked for Matthias in the court of Buda or Visegrad, for example, Benedetto da Maiano, Gregorio de Lorenzo, uh, Kimenti Kamicha, uh, who was the chief architect of Matthias Corvinus, and, and also Francesco Roselli, also a mini miniature. But there were also a lot of uh, Florentine artists who, was, who were commissioned uh, by Matthias, and uh, they only sent his works from Florence, from Italy. To, to Hungary, as uh, Verrocchio uh, or Attavante or the brothers Gerardo and Monte di Giovanni in miniatures. King Corvinus was just 15 when he came to the throne in 1458. His reign is marked by constant struggles for power, battles, invasions and clashes with the Ottoman Empire. He ruled at the same time as Lorenzo the Magnificent in Italy. This exhibition examines their relationship and the influence on one another. The two leaders had many similarities. His close links with Italy were strengthened further by his marriage to the daughter of the King of Naples in 1476. This exhibition looks at how Italy influenced the spread of humanism in Hungary. It's held at Museo San Marco, which is famous for its humanist collections by Niccolò Nicolai. Started in 1444, it was the first public library. The exhibition uses paintings, sculptures and ceramics from 10 countries around the world. The exhibition is on until 2014. For more information, see the Museo di San Marco's website.